All right, connection. short of it. The stream went down. I had no real idea until I looked at the uh, stream manager and saw that, like, ah, I was offline. Uh, <laughs> hmm. And my connection my bitrate looks pretty bad on my end. Suddenly. It was saying it was pretty good for a bit. This may be... Uh, how do you Hmm. Okay, now it says my connection's unstable. Poor network connection detected, but... Yeah, weird. I did, you know, the uh, automatic test, or the network test again. Like, oh, how much, you know, should you set your bit rate? And it gave me, like, the max of 6,500 three times in a row. So I was like, ah... The bit rate should be good now, right? But it apparently uh, yeah, three point six kilobits per second, which isn't so hot. So if you're not going to freeze it, try it again, and see how it goes. Oh, what's this weird thing? Energy shield? Okay, I can't. And then the wind cannon. Yeah, the energy shield. Mmm, it stuttered. It stuttered. Uh, oh no. Yeah, no, I just now noticed the bitrate drop. Come on. Weird. Ah, uh, this is... Ooh, I, I hate this, but... No, we'll give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. Let me check the stream preview to see how that's going. Alright. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. And hope it goes well. Alright! <laughs>
What's this for? Oh. Alright, now it says my connection's excellent. Now that actually keeping a track of it. time you die you lose points but like I there's no other vehicle for me to jack uh still have S rank still have S rank nice all right oh yeah All right. Rico! What? Hey! No, okay. <laughs> All right. Cool. Um All right. So the stream's doing better. The connection's good. Yeah, and a nice flip to close it off. Um, you know what? Let's uh, let's steal some tanks. Yo, Rico! Hey, Rico! You should check out the Prospero Tanques factory. Not far from your position. Our army could use some more tanks. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. I'll get some intel together. All right, so let's let's do an old-fashioned one of these, just to you know get things. <laughs> you know, I've got uh, two S ranks. Let's Sargento, let's I'm at kick some ass. Tankes. Before we take the factory, we need to secure the tank schematics and the weapons designs. Get me coordinates. You need to crack into an underground vault to grab the tank schematics. The weapons designs are developed in the R&D department to the north. I'll let you know when I have them. Thanks for the memories. <laughs> nice one, Muse. Alright, let's... Elevators powered down. They're trying to keep you out of the vault. Find the breakers, hit the power Ooh. back on. Ooh. <laughs>
Oh yes, the the green ones you see are missiles. Uh. All right, that took care of that. Rico. Zip. <laughs> Wait, no, what's that one mean? Um, grappling machine goes. goes. One. And I hear you. Oh. oh, blue is the most dangerous one. Because you see, he's in an exosuit, and I can't grapple him. Why won't you die? Got to see that little down. rocket. Should be a console down there you can access to grab the tank schematics. Take everything you can. Copy that. took enough damage to blow up as it got in. Yes, the hierarchy of dangerous lights. Red, green, and blue. I think they missed something with yellow, but at the same time... Like... I'm trying to think. Is... Red, green, and blue better if... someone suffers from color blindness or not? Not sure. Wrong... There. The scientist is upset at me. The stream's dying again? Hmm, on my end it says it's doing excellent, but at the same time its spread rate is now uh, 4.2 kill. you know. There it is. Four uh, 4.2 thousand kelpits per second. Mm. Uh, where's... Oh, it's... Where is it? Oh, the schematics. Okay, coming back. Okay, that's good. Got the tank schematics. Make sure to look at the bit rate more. Let's nice elevator. Can I go ahead to do something silly? I think I forgot to change setting. Oh well.
Mm, okay, this. Okay, that isn't gonna work. Let's. Hmm. And there we go, full freeze for 10 seconds. Now, let me just pause again. And yeah, now I completely understand Muse about Wonder. Uh, <clears throat> and I appreciate the feedback about the connection. I don't know, like, I don't think the Wi-Fi on my, yeah, the Wi-Fi on my end isn't, like, suffering. I think it's just maybe something going on with Twitch, that, that it's just, that it's having issues. Which is a shame. And yeah, the bitrate did go down from uh, 4,000 to 3,000. Mm. Now let me take a sip of water while I think about this. Mm. Alright, so I was having issues eight hours ago, but I wouldn't... Yeah, then again, there. this isn't been the only day where I'm like, ah, it's time to stream, and then things go weird. So, like, I believe it. Uh, which is a shame, because I honestly really enjoy, you know, streaming, but, like, yeah, I think maybe after this, uh, tank heist. Oh, hello. Yeah, like after this uh, mission, probably gotta go stop the stream early if the connection keeps staying this way. And yeah, like currently, yeah, because I I absolutely get that, like. I would honestly stream more on my PC if my PC could handle streaming more. Because it's such an odd thing of like... My internet connection is actually... Or the home internet is really good. It's just... My PC is my PC. Alright, then that's good to hear that the connections come back. Do a good level. I need a point man scout tank. Listo. Easy's marking a spot for you. See if you find one there. Alright, the Falcon here tank. Did it explode? Yay! I love Rico's ability to just jump out of it the tank, even if it would normally survive that fall. It just kinda explodes. And yeah, I'm glad that <laughs> You know, that you've been having fun watching me play just cause. Just cause we, we, we can't. Uh, or just cause I can't. I don't know. Look, gotta stop trying to force that joke, but yeah. More unit, more position. Hey, then, yeah. I guess I'm getting my words not mixed up, but just. It's fun streaming this game, but it just kinda sucks when, like. Something goes weird with connection. That's not like not an issue I'm causing. It's just like something going weird. This looks like the right tank. Did it blow up? Why can you survive? 
that said, a person has to be given exo armor to survive the kind of nonsense Rico uh, deals with on a normal basis. Whoop. Alright, you are no longer causing me issue. Did I blow up the tank I was looking for? I blew up the tank I was looking for. I find it <laughs> amazing, or amusing, that he has never has to Rico, re recon the area he goes to. Nice. You, you almost made me wish I had a soundboard. <laughs> Just for a sad trombone sound, but yeah, now I need to find... Uh, I just walked through that geometry. Ah! Let's see here. A disappointment. Wow, wow. Falcon here. That's Falcon. Actually, no, that's Point Man. Alright, now to not get this as fun as to go buck wild with tanks, I need to make sure to not blow this one up. Oh boy, it turns on a dime. I don't know if that's the right term for this, or it, it does something weird. Don't know what it does, but it, it does it. It turns. It swivels? I, I guess that's the best way to describe it. It doesn't. Like tear on dime just swivels really fast. Those are mines. I think. Alright. Oh boy. Oh boy. To quote Muse, see the Muse not blowing something up. This game has jumped the shark, Nos. The, the, has jumped the shark now. Yeah. Er, ooh, well, look, I have a tank. I can still blow stuff up, but I can't blow up this specific tank that I'm trying to pilot. What? Oh, it's someone's targeting. I'm not even sure your tank is red as the next white bald guy with a barcode chat. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't think it's uh, it's you know as you know e as good as an infiltrator as uh, Agent Forty Seven. God, I still love the fact that like literally, even, like people just accept it. Look, it's a, a white guy with a... Nice. You gotta show me how to drive one of those. First, you gotta find the weapon designs, though. Oh. Looks like designs oh. for a light right. cannon. Let's grab a uh, completely fresh one. For no real reason. Actually... This can't be used against us. That's more like it. Who's targeting me? Something was targeting me. No clue what. But uh no! Alright, let's just get a move on. And try not to blow up. I say I get blasted. <laughs> if I saw anyone with a barcode tattoo, I would just assume they like consumerism. You know what? You got a point. You got a point. Like, just someone who's, like, really weird. Just really... Just... Just like, hell yeah, consumerism. Working... For... 
Wait, where no position it? was on site. Stand by. Yeah. Um, just like, yeah, I, I just, I am totally a product for the consumer market. I can sell high labor to the highest build better. I don't know. But, actually, no, I'm trying to think. Because, you know, Agent 47, you know, if you see a dude with, like, a barcode on their head, like, it's weird, right? It's obviously weird, but I'm just wondering if I actually saw someone with a barcode tattoo. Like, how would I actually react? <sighs> Need a war chief assault tank to get in here. Maybe near the entrance to the factory. But, yeah, I think... I mean... Hmm. Alright, I got distracted just because of flying around, but I'm trying to... I'm actually wondering, like, how would I react? I mean, a part of me wonders if I would just think, Oh, cool Dark Angel reference. Which is weird, because, like, I haven't seen that show in ages, but, like, it's kind of where my brain would honestly want to go. Excuse me. <laughs> this is a nice thing. <laughs> Yeah, not let me read back the comment or the chat. Well, at this point, we'd assume they liked Hitman games, but if they didn't exist, I don't know, maybe something in someone decoding? Maybe. Like, it's kind of. Hmm. I could honk ball in the tank. And also, get out of my fucking business. Thank you. Maybe someone. No, I. Hmm. Okay. Or no, I. Maybe. Yeah. I don't know. It's it's a weird thing. Cause like you know. Well, then again, in Hitman, it's like, oh, here's this first you know, uh, one of our, you know, like, you know, a, uh, a mob is awaiting, like, a, uh, a member from out of town, you know, and they're like, oh, this dude randomly has a tattoo, a Barco tattoo on the back of their head. And it's like, I think you would notice that. Like, someone would talk about that, right? Like, you know, people... Like, if someone who wears glasses all the time decides to wear contacts, like, people talk about it. You're like, oh, hey, you look weird. <laughs> look for a console you can download the designs from. Right, so I, I feel like people would talk about that. And it's like, hey, you Tony... No, no one told me that Tony has barcode Got back there. Then again, designs. there are the enforcers. Nice. You know what? I think that's that's, everything. <laughs> that's why. You just gotta raise the transmitter so Easy can decrypt those schematics. It's near the entrance. Standing by. You know what? I think that's why the enforcers are like so common in some levels. It's just that they know. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. Let me read the chat. It's like. Uh, pseudo muse. It's like those uh, people who get their Bitcoin access code tattooed on themselves. Just super bizarre. Yeah, no, that I didn't know that was a thing. 
I mean, I believe it. Someone beat that into Bitcoin. Yeah. Yeah, there's people that into Bitcoin. Yeah. Yeah, no. God, I didn't even think that was a thing, but no, yeah, I can see that. Gosh. Um, but yeah, you know, like, if, if, uh, Agent 47 didn't have that tattoo, there'd be a whole lot less enforcers that can, like, notice who he was. Just because, like, you know, like, oh, a waitstaff, nice. you know, like, a, a chef at a famous hotel, you know, may not remember everyone who comes in, but, like, they know they would remember the weird, the, like, the weird white bald dude that specifically has a tattoo on the top of their head. Unlike the other white bald dude who didn't have a tattoo on the back of their head, who wore suspiciously the same uh, <laughs> size clothing. As... How many balloons does it take to send this into the sky? I'm sending you off to hell. Alright, you went straight to hell. Anyway... What? Yeah, I had to read the chat. I see. To me, I just assume there's not a bunch of bald dudes as there is, uh, as there is. Uh, they all just get have the same hairdresser that's too enthusiastic. No, Ed, you're probably right. Especially, <laughs> especially in the uh, okay. Transmitter is going uh, Pitman universe. Excuse me, just want to get a quick drink of water. Nope. I feel like something's being shot at. No way I can't notice. Game? Seriously? You're gonna have a turret there, but then oh, just have mind. tanks chilling here. Shooting at the thing I need to defend. Thanks. Thank you, Red, on its way. We'll be on site shortly. I have the threshold decrypted. Still working on the rest. I said short back and sides, not back. <laughs> Not no back in sides. Like yeah, no, I, I believe uh, just like they're Our like. in trouble, Rico. We can't let it go down, or we're sunk. <laughs> All right, just. Focusing on committing some violence. But yeah, now it that would make sense to me on why Like everyone's just like, oh you're suddenly bald? Yeah, yeah now that happens. Hairdressers just kinda get too into it. Come on. Come on! No. Okay. We completed. What did you just say? Ah. Uh, uh, I have to go. God. I can't believe I paused it right and they're saying the best line. Yeah, that was a close one. And I, I'm glad that straight up. 
Uh, someone said the phrase, thanks for doing this. That's so fucking corny. Alright, front line moved up. Hmm, the pit rate... Uh, it says my uh, stream quality is excellent, but... The bit rate is much lower than the, uh... Okay, thanks for telling me about the front line. You told me that twice in a row. Production speed. Just max. Alright, yeah, not noticing any current issues. I'm wondering if I should keep... going... It's, like, it's not as high as it should be. Stretch my legs. But... One of Espinosa's lackeys is transporting a fake relic in a vehicle. Let's... Would you destroy it, please? Let's commit some violence, but then... Maybe I'll push on ahead? <laughs> I don't know, it's weird. Like... That's it for that vehicle, Javi. Yeah. Yeah, I know, it's weird. Like, I want to start the DLC. Like, that was what I was really excited about. Uh, you know, for this week, starting out. In... Uh, let me get back to it. All the way over here. Like, ah, I want to go to DLC Island and do <clears throat> the artifact. Alright, there's been no issue for about 20 minutes. Then... Is gone. Hmm. Then yeah, let's give it a shot. Do I have any towns near here? Ah, all right. Mm. The bit rate could be higher. Um, let me just check the uh, player real quick. Thanks for flying with the army of chaos. Yeah, it's stars, excellent, what not. Oh yeah, let's. Get this started. <sighs> All right. Actually, no. Oh yeah, let's let's do this one real quick. Or no, let's let's do the fun thing. I can do the wingsuit challenge later. That's not water, that's chocolate milk. I mean... I mean... It looks too too much on the yellow side to be chocolate milk. <laughs> but yeah. Let's... Let's... Alright, so... What I know of this uh, DLC... Is that there's... Uh, an ancient evil that was sealed away. A rival of Javi, our ar archaeologist friend who wants to uncover the truth about the... Uh, I forget their name. Of the indigenous, you know, the indigenous people to Solis. 
Because, like, for years, the Espinosa family has been spreading their truth of, you know, the people. Calling them just, you know, savages and brutes and whatnot. But then, a rival of his does something, uncovers some messed up evil stuff, or some, like, some weird bug things. And we gotta, we gotta stop it. Yep, Javi has received an unsettling message from an old colleague. Meet Javi and find out what is disturbing him. Let's go. Javi, an archaeologist named Valencia invited me to join him on a dig. Out on that island. It's your old friend. Simon Valencia knows I'm the last person in Solis that would ever help him. But still, he asked. Senor Rodriguez. Let's go. Let's go to Isla de los Anillos. I appreciate Gosh. you coming yeah, it to me, help that. Oh. This may not concern Otorongo, but I believe it's important. My former colleague, Valencia, told me that he had a lead on an ancient artifact. What's the problem? Simon comes from a wealthy family, and he frequently contracts the Black Hand for security. He pursues rare artifacts and sells them to the highest bidder. Simon could always find the price for the priceless. Then why do you want to help him? I don't. I want to stop him. Tell me about this island. Isla de los Anillos. It holds a necropolis that was discovered there years ago. And Valencia wants to... I have no idea. Archaeologists believe it was once used as a burial site. Yet, all of the sarcophagi were empty. Yes, in Necropolis, and yeah. I forgot what I was going to say before <laughs> they started talking. See, oh, just... si. this site is one of the oldest on Solis. Pre Espinosa, pre Otorongo, pre everything. And Simon told me that he uncovered something incredible. Valencia told me to meet him at an observation post on the rim of the crater. Let's land there, por favor. Yeah, this is really cool. And I love the fact that it's pre... Uh, which is like the last emperor of, of the indigenous people's release. So it's just like, it's, it's just incredibly old. This will do. I'm going to look around. Enrico, try not to disturb the site any more than necessary. Gracias. Um. No, I don't want to grab on to things if I don't need to, but yeah. Here. That did something, Javi. Look at the ring surrounding the city, Rico. Troubling. Dime. I f found a large arch. Find some way to move it, Rico. We have to hurry. Valencia may already be three steps ahead of us. Uh... Oh, rotate it? Rotate it. Let me actually get close to it. Hmm. Rotate it. Whoa. He's moving, Javi. Oh, I'm moving in the wrong way. Oh, actually, I wonder... Okay, wrong. 
Uh, let me turn this off. Horizontal. 30 seconds. Fast. No modification. Uh, you may need to rotate the large rings and align the arch with something. Oh yeah, no, you're you're absolutely right. This is probably a city lock, and I am sending that thing uh fly. <laughs> Let me... Okay, I think I'm close to aligning it, actually. Actually, let me... Okay, no, I think I'm... Okay, let me actually look at this. This looks pretty aligned. There it... Mm. And yeah, this is very much a city lock. Like, everything about this looks like it's supposed to lock things in. Though, I'm wondering. Oh! Okay, that's probably where it actually locks up. Because, yeah, like, a lot of the other structures have very complex, like, mechanisms for locking. So this having something, or this being something like that, makes a lot of sense. Oof, okay. is locked into place now. Bueno. Mm. Try moving the others. Mm. Javi? Javi, you sure this is a good idea? Valencia must seems like a very bad one. The arches. He always liked intuition. You really don't like this guy, Javi. Did I not mention it? Simon Valencia reported my collection of stolen artifacts to the Black Hand. He is the reason I spent nine years in prison. Is that all? <laughs> he wears a chakana around his neck. I don't know what that means. It means he's an idiot, Senor Rodriguez. Oh yeah, this is absolutely a, a lock. Simone has made some impressive discoveries in this journey. <laughs> but why leave it in such a hurry? We're just picking the Stargate coordinates. No, what, Muse? You're right, we are just activating the Stargate coordinates. <laughs> also, something tells me... Uh, this, you know, rich boy knew what he was doing and just like like, ah, yes, I'll get Javi's out of prison. He's smart. And I know I'll get his attention. The center of the city. Look! Can you investigate?
Oh no. I'm here. Oh. You should see four pillars. And a stone sculpture in the middle. Let's see. Simone's notes seem to indicate. See. Are the levers attached to the pillars? See. Si. Oh. Can you pull the levers? Uh, Harry, this is an incredibly terrible idea, and you know it. Simone's artifact. I love all the turquoise and whatever cobalt. I don't. I don't know what this blue sapphire-looking gem is, but it looks very alien. And also, this is straight up a, a <laughs> straight up a crossbow. Ha! You found it. I knew it was here. Simon Valencia. Javi has mentioned me. See. Si. You're the idiot. And you're the one that did the idiot's dirty work for him. Drop the crossbow. Thank you for doing this for me. I knew you wouldn't be able to stay away. You always counted on me to do the real work. You don't know what you're doing, Simon. <laughs> From what I've deduced, this object holds one of the greatest treasures of the Kacha people. Now who's the idiot? Harvey, run! Oh, no, it means, and you're right, it was depicting a tentacle monster spreading across an island. And yeah, the blue gem does look like Paul Sopel. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh! What the hell are those things? They can be killed at least. Oh! Oh god. god it, these things just oh god. Keep what was that? Oh, fuck, I just died. <laughs> oh, and, uh,. Quoting chat to the muse. OMG, I was right? I was memeing. Shit, shit, shit. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, yeah, it's a tentacle monster spreading across an island. What the hell are those things? They can be killed at least. These things just keep coming. What was that? Rico! Covey, are you alright? Those things stopped chasing me at some point. There's a helicopter here. Huh? Then you get back to the mainland. I'm not leaving without you, senor. You can fly the helicopter? Please hurry. Bug. Oh boy. <laughs> and yes, it is. Way to go understanding that mural. Crossbows to name this weapon. And yeah, this is just a bad time. For most everything. 
so yeah, the, the, you know, the Ketchup people found a way to, uh... What? Okay. Hell, hell world is contained. That's good. What the fuck? What <laughs> of that strange atmosphere? Those creatures. I don't think they can leave. Good. Did you hear that voice, Rico? It sounded like. Uh... I heard it, Javi. Lost contact with Valencia. Send more units. Vámonos. Get in. <laughs> what the hell were those things, Javi? I don't know, Rico. They look like some kind of bug. I'm no biologist, but I doubt an insect that size has lived on the surface of our planet for some time. Anything in that journal about how we stop these things? Let me look. I see one. He translated this symbol as gold. It means demon. That's not good. No, no, oh. no, 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 no. Let's land over there. Oh. I'd rather not go anywhere near those things again. Seems like oh, they no. found their way off the island. Now it means, uh, first, like, yeah, you're just thinking here. Yeah, I was looking at the black, uh, the black spikes as well. I was just, they seem really out of place. Like, nothing else in the Kacha people's, like, art, uh, architecture has stuff like that. Thank you, Rico. Whew, that was nice. Better check that out. And we have the demon crossbow. And apparently, we can have it supply drop to us. Uh, what time is it? What? Let's deal with this. Also, let me. Hey, land and tr figure something out. Apparently, it's sort of quick draw. Overdraw. Okay, so it has alternate fire. Bobby, mode. I'm heading it to Via Cusi. See if I can get rid of those things. I'll keep looking through Simon's journal. There's so much information here. Where did he find the. Those creatures are oh, here. This is. Black Hand are fighting them. I found its source. There are some tendrils wrapped around it. See where they lead, Rico. I can't make a dent in these tendrils. Need to find another way to get rid of them. These things are disgusting. Now what? I have yet to try something. Okay, conventional weapons can still blow stuff up, but something tells me I want to be using the crossbow. It is up some sort of weird pocket. One of the tendrils must be retreating back to the source. That's it, Rico. Look for another. <clears throat> okay, I think the demon crossbow is just better at taking out demon things. What? 
Okay. They can be killed by conventional means. What's my other weapon? Railgun. It ain't bad. God. <laughs> For a railgun, it should really, uh... Another tendril is retreating. And a tree. Their enemies. Keep it up. <sighs> a tentacle that has a mushroom tip, mushroom tip on it. Careful, just cuz you're getting whatever. You... <laughs> um... Let's see if... These place shuts helps. down drones. What? This place shuts. Oh. Oh. It doesn't like. Oh. Okay, yeah, no, I think... <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Okay, so they can just charge at me and explode. Good to know. Good to know. Hmm. Alright, full ammo. Let me get a different gun. Different secondary gun, that is. Yeah, no, they're incredibly oh, tough on the charge. Heavy. First the growth, then the source recall. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's fun <laughs> bopping them when they're charged up like that. Oh, and it bleeds. Delightful. Alright, where's the... Ugly one, aren't you? I wonder if this helps. That was all of them. All right. Source recall. It should be vulnerable now. Uh. The dendros around the source are gone. It still has some sort of shell though. Use that retract motor you appropriated for me. Oof. He doesn't like that. You must destroy that source, Rico. Oof. That hits like a truck. Oh, 
fuck? And yeah, the Allen gun is amazing. It's honestly pretty fun, but... Uh, <laughs> like, it's taking these things out in one shot. But I think there, I should be using the uh, lightning gun just to clear the numbers Kusina. out. First the growth, then the source recall. Okay, thankfully it saves my progress. At least a bit. Boxed it. It's small. Ooh, come on. Pull apart the shell. See if you can destroy what's underneath. Hate these things. All right. Let me just. All right. The bug zapper is good. For just playing out large numbers. Doesn't like that. You must destroy that source, Rico. Yeah, I don't want to see whatever the hell comes out of, out of that egg. Happy. Not sure where they keep coming from. I suggest you focus on the source, the cause, not the symptoms. See? on the just cause infestation is gone my associates tell me that more have appeared all across Solis we need to take out that thing back on the island indeed but there's a matter of the cocoon and the tendrils surrounding the original artifact extrapolating from Valencia's notes the Kacha people once had to seal away this thing Simon also had a name for it. Uchasunku. Our first priority must be to destroy the infestations on the mainland. In the meantime, I will see if this journal has any answers on how to make this Uchasunku vulnerable. Then we destroy it. Oh no. And yeah, I mean, nice. Also fi finally realized why it's called Just Cause. <laughs> yes, you're fighting for a cause which is just, and also you're doing things just cause. It's great. And also, yeah, this whole fucking uh, place got wrecked. I can still do a boat stunt. Uh, <laughs> the the boat actually exists. It survived. It's People cool. just jamming. Okay, sure. That counts. All right. Okay, you know what? Also, I love how this literally goes off the list of the uh, supply restock and production speed in factories. Oh boy. What new hell have we... Most Demonials. Alright, you know what? <laughs> you beat yourself. Epic. Yep. Oh, let's go here. Let's not use the boat, just because uh, it no longer works.
You know what? Let's get an airdrop over there. Can I get an airdrop over here? Well, I can get an airdrop over here, and that's quicker. So. And know what? You're right, Muse. I am also getting a Starship Troopers vibe from this, because, you know, they're like weird alien demon bug things. Except they're more colorful, Rigo, which give him hell. is tight. I'm digging the strange colors. Yeah, a lot of this is very strong Starship Troopers vibe. More of the creatures here. Some dead animals. Interesting. They don't seem to be able to take control of the animals. Let's hope not. They didn't need that. No, I, I think my plan will be to try to clear things out using... Oh wait, no, I need to destroy the gross first. That's one of it, and the game's one chugging a bit. Oh boy, the chugging. Where's the main... You know what? Let's defeat weird... Eldritch ancient monstrosities. Uh, Gotta breathe. <laughs> with a uh, sci fi deck. Oh, no, I just have to try out. Will the lightning or the storm grenade actually work up here? I am running out of ammo. Hmm. I should find that looks a like a Venus flight trap. You should be able to pull that shell apart. Find something vulnerable. Oh. Facing them off bugs, the color situations are warnings that they are bad for eating. Yeah, true. Uh, anything... Anything that seems to be vertical gas columns is important bits, it seems like. No, you're right. That does seem to be the vibe. Uh... Oh, 
Oh yeah, they have rhino heads. And also, I need a machine gun at some point, just because, uh, these things... SMG. That works. I just need something fast for when I'm getting swarmed. Oh wait, was that all the rhino heads? Okay, no. I feel like I'm missing one. Oh, that's fucked up. I love that. This is more of an emergency weapon, because it's fast, but it's not... Oh, and I'm now just getting it that those things are latching on top of the heads of the soldiers to uh, mind control them. That's fun. These things are disgusting. Playful. What's actually getting squeaked out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Squish. That's that's yeah. Thank you, Rico, for just saying squish. That, but, yeah, no. They, they actually did a pretty good job of making this, like, ah, uh, these things are terrifying and awful. In a way that, like, works. Ah, oh, God. Um, <laughs> where's the smoke? Okay. Let me fly a- alright. Alright, I'm gonna wait to recharge a bit. Okay, that wasn't what I was originally planning to do. But, uh... Oh boy, these things sure are... What? And I blow myself up, of course. Of course. No, I had to try it, though. Oh, okay, also top of screen in the middle indicate how many tendril there were. Alright, that, that makes sense. I kind of noticed it, but the thing is, I have my kind of, uh, uh, stream display deal of, like, 
the kind of general status at the top of the screen so that it doesn't block out a lot of the other important details on screen so that makes sense. Uh, it's a shame that now there's something that actually Still takes up that spot because most of the time it's like it's uh, for, for use. Alright. Quick draw, overdraw. Okay, overdraws. Very strong. Okay, I think that did it, which is good. I almost died again. <laughs> Got rid of the infestation by the farm. Good job, senor. Hopefully those people can rebuild. Delightful. Yeah, no, this is... Yeah, this is fun, and it's honestly pretty difficult. I appreciate, the, you know, the checkpointing, though, so that it's not too frustrating. But yeah, it's, it's interesting, because it's like... This crossbow packs a punch, especially since... It can take out, like, when it's overdrawn, it can take out those, uh... The weird eye things growing on the egg, or that are part of the egg, whatever the hell that is. It can take them out in like one shot, which is that stupid strong, which is weird because it's not like, like they're both kind of explosive, but it's hard to tell because not many things <laughs> tend to have that much like health for an individual enemy. So yeah, this thing is fun. And, yeah, I'm looking forward to this, you know. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's one thing I really appreciate about this game, that it has good checkpoints. Like, it has pretty solid checkpoints. For this, it seems to be after each time you take out uh, the tendrils. And, yeah, like, you know, it's kind of like usually halfway points tend to be, like, checkpointed. Or, like... If there's like uh, a thing where you had to survive or keep something up and running for a few minutes, like right before that will usually be a checkpoint. Yeah. It does a good job with that. And also, again, this thing looks tight. It's a weird fucking ancient South American crossbow or automated crossbow nonsense that has weird glowing. I think that's like bits of one of those bugs that we keep killing that form like the uh, front of it so that's tight but yeah yeah I think this is around the time where I normally end anyway so yeah I'm gonna yeah no thanks for sticking around and yeah this is kind of annoying that you know the no I, I just have to test this out on a fucking tank or helicopter. But yeah, not and yeah, you're welcome, Muse. Glad that <laughs> my streams are fun to watch. And that thankfully the issue cleared up. Because I was, yeah, I was, wasn't looking forward to just, you know, calling it quits because I messed up once, but it can be hard to tell. No to flip, but not <laughs> And let's see here. Moose. <laughs> uh, not, yeah, to read it, uh, your messages. Thanks for streaming, sticking through the issues. Uh, you, 
you are causing the hell to flip out, but not blow up. Oh wow, that actually... Oh wow! Okay, yeah, this... yeah, overdraw is strong and that actually pierces through enemies. Oh boy. Anyway! <laughs> yeah, thanks for watching and I'm glad that the, uh... uh Internet issues cleared up. But yeah. God, I'm having fun with this. But yeah, again, thanks for watching. And putting it with internet issues. But yeah, I'm yeah. I'm looking forward to this. And let me just how many more of these do I got? Most of them on the at the church, at the compound, at in the lake. At the crash. Oh yeah, there's a, a a jet that crashed inside. A cargo jet has crashed inside of infestation. They're black hand on site. But they're losing ground. And at a mountain. Huh. Fun times. Oh yeah, thanks views. Yeah, see you for the game week. I hope you have a lovely week as well. But yeah. Thanks for watching and See you next week at yeah you know, Thursday eight PM ish, etc. etc. EST. Ciao.